Berries. Today we're here at the chicken's house and there has been a massive update on Bloxburg. It is now officially full and there is loads of decorations for Halloween to choose from now. So today that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be decorating the house for Olive. She isn't here at the moment. So we're going to surprise her by decorating the whole house with Halloween stuff. And also there's other things there too. But that's the main thing what we're going to be doing today. Maybe throw in a few other things, you know, change the bathrooms a bit because there have been some new baths added and things in the bathroom, which would be cool. New showers. New right. showers, yeah. Mirrors. New mirrors. So yes, if you guys haven't already seen it, then make sure you jump on Bloxburg and go take a look for yourself because it is a massive update. Well, I think it's pretty big. In fact, let me show you outside. You can see this. It's night time at the moment. But look at that. Look, it is officially full. I think when we started playing Bloxburg, wasn't it like the... I think it might have been, you know. It was around this time, wasn't it? Yeah. This time last year. But yes, look at this. So beautiful trees, yellow, red, green, orange. Oh, I just want to walk straight through you. Yeah. When you did the intro and you said it's officially fall, I thought you meant Bloxburg is fall. They're taking no more players. <laughs> if, you, if you're not on, you'll never be able to get on. It's You've fall. missed out. You are not on the list. <laughs> A lot of you guys try and give us ship names, right? And here we are together. Look at that. Aren't we beautiful? <laughs> Isn't this the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? Right, so let's take a look at the things. So, go to the new section. And there's pumpkins and a happy ghost. He's like quite big. Bigger than you'd think. Hmm. Oh, I know. We can put a hanging bat at the door. Look. Ooh. Oh, yeah, because there is a roof there. Oh, wait, let's look what this looks like so far. Ooh, it looks very cool. Okay, we're back with Olive, and here we are outside our house that we decorated. This is the outside decorations, and I've just put some of these around. The lights aren't on at the moment, but we will put those on so you can see how these look. We've put some pumpkins out the front. <gasps> Do you like that? It's spooky, isn't it? Yeah. The tombs, uh, the gravestones, the cauldron. Yeah, cauldron. Look at that. <gasps> Oh, cold dry. Yeah. Right, some hay bales too. Look, we can sit on. Look at that. Oh, oh, can you? Right. Yeah, look. That's cool. Oh, oh. all random Being ways, like but nice. I'll leave her face in the same way. Yeah, well, 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 well. This is a better view anyway. Right, so Olive, we have decorated inside, but the lights went off. <gasps> oh, no. All the lights are off. So we want better see it properly. We want to try and find where the electric box is. The good news is, though, we do have some flashlights. So we'll be able to see a little bit in there. We've got yeah. three flashlights. As soon as we open the door, should we do it, Amber? Yeah. I mean... Right, Olive, come and stay close to Mummy, okay? Don't go too far because it might be a bit scary, but you can hold my hand and tell me if you're too scared, okay? Mm-hmm. Let's go in. <gasps> Ooh. Look at the smoke. Smoke, look at the bats in there. <gasps> I'm in. Let's close the door. Now there's a flashlight. Pick up a flashlight to the right. Look here. Oh. Take that. Look. Okay. So you can see properly. Look at that. Nice. <gasps> a spider! Right in front of us! Quick! Oh, get away from him! Run away from it! Mm. Okay, ignore the lines, okay? There's been a bit of an error, people. With These the are bat. supposed to be bats, but for some they're reason, going crazy. they're going mental. It's supposed to be that up here, but for some reason, the line has gone round, and for some reason, <laughs> the bats are just all over the place. But look. <gasps> bats here, there's pumpkins. Pumpkins about. Watch out, Ollie, big spider. <gasps> oh my no! gosh, it's huge. Run! Get away, get away. You can't go that way into the kitchen. No. Oh, ghost. <gasps> Just don't look at the ghost. Look at this way. Look, because we can go past him. <gasps> Ooh. A tomb. Someone died here. It says oof. 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 And he's protected by spiders and these pumpkins. Yes, he's protected. Who could be there? I wonder. <gasps> What's in here? More tombs here. Spiders. Spiders, yeah. Bats going crazy still. Bats going crazy. Look at them. They're going crazy. They're in the floor. <gasps> See, the bats <laughs> are going crazy. Everywhere. Spooky in here. It's spooky. Spooky. <gasps> Another ghost. Oh, he's <gasps> extra green. Yeah, I've made him extra green. Oh, look, candy. Candy. Oh, candy. See if you can take some. Oh, you can. Take some candy. Oops. Oh, you just pick up. I thought I was going to eat it, but you can't. <gasps> you just take it about. I was wanting candy. I've been tricked. <laughs> Hold on. 
I'm gonna pick my flashlight back up. <gasps> I forgot about the big massive spider! Ah! Ah! Right. Oh no. Where's daddy oh. gone? <gasps> Where's dad? Daddy. Daddy. Where is he? Should we try and find him? Yeah. Where he's gone? Daddy. <gasps> oh my god. It says Richie YT, right? <laughs> I was scared, Jen. We did not see him with his name tag in there. <laughs> oh, did he come up above? Yeah, it ruined my prank. It ruined it. Oof. Oh, oh, wow. That is good. So this is the update. How cool is it all? These, like, all these decorations. We can make this. This is, this is just the start of it. We just scattered these about for now. But, oh, no. Don't get in there. Oh, I'll leave. Oh, my gosh. I'm turning to a zombie. Oh. 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 You're very stinky. Very stinky zombie. No, I'm a zombie. So this is basically the update here. So you can put loads of things in. We've put fog machines to make it look a bit spooky, you know, and smoky about. But we'll probably do this. I really want to do a proper thing of decorating the whole place. Like, I don't know, make a scary house or something. I think that would be, be really, really cool. cool. But this is just a way to show you, you know, what you can do with this. For now. Should I turn the lights on? But yeah, let's go and let's go and turn the lights back on. You can see what it's like with the lights on too. Oh my god, we are stinky. Wow, wow. I prefer, prefer the lights off, to be honest. You don't get to see that. But yeah, this is what it's like with the lights on. I don't know what happened with the bats, guys. Like I said before, look. <laughs> this is what they're supposed to look like. And this is, for some reason, when we log back on, this is what's happened. Um, It could be like a laser thing when you're trying to get over it. Like, jump <laughs> over that. Go underneath this. Don't set the alarms off. Yeah, that's what it is. But I don't know. I don't know what's going on with that. But, Missy, you've had a long day today, been out, and you come home, been a bit scared. So let's go upstairs, give you a bath. In the new bath, by the way, we've got a new bath. Oh, and we've had new flooring done, guys. Some new flooring for the kitchen. Some new flooring for the living room, which is pretty nice. I do like this wood. But yes, oh, there's a scary mirror here, too. I do look frightening. Look how stinky I look. <laughs> the scariest thing of all. I think you're the one that needs the bath, Amber. Oh, I think we all need a bath. Maybe oh, do we? me. Yeah, I've right. already had my bath. Here you go. Let me run the bath for you. There you go. Nice. Oops. I'm fine. I'm fine, okay? I don't need to buy stuff. Right, I'm going to get in the shower at the same time then. Right, we can get out now, Missy. You've been in there for a while. And come and brush your teeth and brush your hair. I should even brush my hair. That beautiful pink toothbrush. It's been an eventful day, I think. And the best thing about this as well is that there's going to be a lot more Halloween videos coming up soon. A lot more spooky stuff. This is just an update video. But I have a lot in store. I didn't put anything in Olive's room because this is a safe place for Olive. I don't want it to be too scary. You know, it's downstairs and stuff is fine. But it can be hard to sleep if you see something that scares yeah, you in your room. Yeah, it does. I remember when I was young, I saw a pile of clothes at the mm -hmm. end of the hall that I could yeah. see from my bed, and I thought it was an octopus. <laughs> and then it took me about half an hour, and I got up, and I was like, what is this? And it was a pile of clothes. I was like, oh, okay, Why would you think there was an octopus in your room? Because your imagination goes wild, doesn't it? It's like, oh, it looks like an octopus. A killer octopus coming to kill me! How did it even get here? I don't know. <laughs> Ready for bed? Yes. Hopefully you haven't been too scared today. This is your safe place, then nothing goes wrong. Right, she said nothing is a good night, Olive. Sweet dreams. Oh, good night, Olive. It looks like you need to go off. to bed as well, Amber. I do. I'm so tired. So tired. Turn the lights off. If you've got any trouble sleeping, then make sure you come and tell Mummy, okay? Yeah. Good night. Night. Night, Olive. Oh, that has been a spoopy day. Lots yes, of things to show you. Um. Oh, this is a new bath I have. Look, you guys like this new bath as well. I've had this new bath installed. When I was younger, guys, my biggest fear was that, oh no, just to go to work. No thanks. <laughs> when I was younger, my biggest fear was that there was a monster underneath my bed. Every single night I'd have the same nightmare that a monster was underneath my bed. And when I would go to jump off, he would drag me under. I'd always have that nightmare. And it was the scariest thing. I was petrified. Even now, I still think it affects me because I don't like any of my like limbs dangling over the bed i make sure i'm all on the bed safe and sound even though i know there's no monsters obviously but it's just weird isn't it that was my biggest fear so i want to ask you guys what is your biggest fear or what is your nightmares that you have um because it's interesting to know which have you got any nightmares yes i have nightmares now that i'm getting chased by a tiger 
Oh, oh, he still has those. Ages. Yes. That's scary. And Did you have any one when you were younger? Um, I remember one. It's weird how your brain just makes them up. I was go- I was at school with my mm-hmm. brother, my older brother, and it was at my school in the back, in like the garden, not the garden, like the, the field area of it. Yeah. And we were like, there was this big panda and he was fighting everyone. Your one's sweet. always about big cats, isn't it? Is a panda a cat? I don't think he is. Oh, it's in the cat family. A big animal. Is it? What, a panther? No, no, panda. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. I was like, what? Is it a cat? <laughs> oh my gosh, now I'm like an idiot. No, I just thought, I, I thought you sounded like you said panther. That would have been more scary. Yeah. Actually, no, this was a terrifying panda. He was going oh, crazy. That is but he was scary, standing on right? his hind legs and he was just, he was punching people. It wasn't even like <laughs> biting them. That is scary. With my dream, I'll be more specific what my one was. This is the scary part about my dream. So what would happen? I'd have it all the time. It's weird because like, it's like, how did I not know in my dream that this was going to happen? Because I have it every night. So we'd have nightmares like that. <laughs> But what it would be is that me and Chelsea, my older sister, used to share a room and her bed was on one side and my bed was on the other. And we used to be having fun bouncing on our beds. So I'd be jumping on my bed and she was jumping on her bed. And then afterwards, Chelsea jumped down and then she ran out the room. So then I jumped down to follow her because I always follow your older sister. And then my feet were stuck on the floor and I couldn't move because my feet were stuck. And then I tried to call her and say, Chelsea, Chelsea. But then I'd lost my voice. So I couldn't scream. And then and then the monster would count down three, two, one. And then he dragged me under. But I always woke up as I got dragged under. Oh, my gosh. That's Isn't very that scary. scary. That's really scary. Yeah, it was really scary. It's like the scariest dream you can have, I feel like. But, you know. Not just, as scary as a fighting panda. Well, yeah, panda, a big cat. But, yeah, <laughs> there is no such thing as monsters, guys. So there's nothing under your bed. And nowadays, I know there's nothing under my bed because there's so much mess underneath there. With loads of boxes and shoes, there's no way a monster could ever fit under there. But anyway, I'll leave it at that. I'll have another bath for my luxurious bath. Let me know what kind of nightmares you guys have. I think it'll be interesting if we have the same ones. Or if you guys have similar ones to me. Or Rich and his Pandal Dreams. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys liked it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye, guys.